Here we'll be completing another example of the product rule. So here's a reminder of the steps involved. Pause at this point if you wish to review them. So in our example you can see the function involved is the product of two other functions. So you have 12x minus 7 multiplied by log to the base e of 4x. So first we identify u and v. So u will be 12x minus 7 and v will be ln 4x. Differentiate to get du dx. So we differentiate this, we get 12 with a minus 7, constant just differentiates to 0. Differentiate v, dv dx. So it's ln 4x. So that will differentiate to 1 over 4x. We also differentiate the 4x and multiply. So we'll be multiplying by 4. So that gives us 4 over 4x, which is equal to 1 over x. So at this point we've completed the first two steps. Next we've to sub in our values into the formula. So you can see on the right hand side they're the values we've figured out. So next we just sub them into our formula here. So dy dx that'll be equal to u times dv dx. So u is 12x minus 7 multiplied by dv dx which is 1 over x. v is ln 4x and that's multiplied by du dx which is equal to 12. So we complete our multiplication here. 12x by 1 over x gives us 12x over x. Minus 7 by 1 over x gives us minus 7 over x plus 12 times ln 4x. So our last step is just to simplify it down. So 12x divided by x is 12 with minus 7 over x plus 12 times ln 4x. And that's our equation completed. So we've completed two of the examples of the product rule There are two more here, you can try yourself. Pause this point to view them. These are the solutions to the problems just shown, so pause this point if you wish to view these also.